Iceco dual fridge freezer. All right, well, it's raining off and on, and uh, I just got the awning set up real quick, so I'll get situated now. Well, as you can see, I'm all set up out here. Got the fire going because it's a little chilly out. The weather really hasn't made up its mind what it wants to do today. It's blue sky, it's cloudy, it's rain, and the sun's coming out. So, if it starts raining, sorry about all the noise, but nothing I can do about that. But what I got here is my ice co dual zone fridge freezer it's the VL60 model it's pretty cool so you can have different temperatures one on each side so you can have a freezer or a fridge or you could do both fridge or both freezer uh, the cool thing about this is instead of just having a fridge I'm gonna have a real drink here. It has nice sturdy latches. So if you're into overlanding, camping, or tailgating, this fridge freezer will work great for you. You could put all the drinks in one side and have a bunch of ice in the other. Look at that nice frosty glass. So normally when I'm out, I just have a beer or a soda because uh, I don't carry ice with me. But now that I got the freezer, I have ice. a proper drink. So check out all this room in here. This is where we carry all of our normal food. 
and we have it set like around say like 40 degrees or so a little less depending on what's in here and actually you can see here it tells you what the recommendations are so that's pretty cool also it has nice easy to grab baskets so you can take this out fill it up at the store in your fridge and just set it back in there because this fridge does weigh 65 pounds then over here the freezer side yeah it's it's nice and cold in here got an ice cube in there got a nice light on each side It's really handy. Another cool thing about having a metal fridge is you can put your favorite bottle opener on it or whatever other magnets you want. So I have been using a single zone fridge by another brand and it did the job uh, but it made it a little bit more difficult to get into it for drinks while driving because it was a single opening uh, opened up from one side. This here, uh, I can get into my drink side or the freezer side or whatever a lot easier while I'm traveling. So that's nice. And my other fridge, it would not keep a super cold temperature. Uh, it worked well for the normal food and stuff, but couldn't get super cold. So this here has uh, been doing a really nice job so far at keeping stuff cold and freezing. So I'm really happy with that. So I just put a thermometer inside. Let's see what it's like. I just recently turned it down to eco mode and the battery protection down to low. So let's see what the actual temperature is in there. So here's the temperature. Just pulled it out and it is nice and cold. You can see there that it's uh, pulling about 46, 47 watts. It's really quiet. Uh, sun's trying to come out again. That's nice. I'm not really into the uh, unboxing videos, but for some reason, some people are. So here's me unboxing it just got delivered so the storage volume on this is 60 liters the temperature range for this unit is 0 degrees Fahrenheit to 50 degrees Fahrenheit the length for this is 31.2 width is 19.5 and the height is 18.9 inches It comes with a six foot AC wall outlet cable and an eight foot DC cigarette lighter plug. Got the power cord. And a nice protective blanket here. That's pretty cool. So there's your unboxing video. So I'm really pleased with this VL60 Ice Co. Dual Zone Fridge Freezer. It's working out really well so far. And it's going to be really nice in the summer. We'll be able to bring ice cream on our trips. So that'll be cool. Well, I hope you enjoyed the video and maybe learned something about the fridge. Like I say, it's working out well for me and uh, might be useful for you as well. So I'll catch you next time.